Our Condor Reminders. Thank you for walking. Thank you for using Champ's Level 1 voices. Thank you for being aware of those around you. Thank you for staying to the right. Thank you for continuously moving. And thank you for doing your part to keep our campus clean. Good morning, everybody. I'm Lindsay. And I'm Chris, and welcome to News from the Nest number two. The first item we want to talk about to you this morning is our wonderful condor mascot. He is big, he's blue, and well, of course, awesome. He does have a problem, though. What's that? He has no name. So we're asking you to come by the ASB room, room 29, and let us know what you think we should call our wonderful Isbell mascot. If you are chosen, then you will see some cool Isbell swag and a picture of you and your Connor in the yearbook. That sounds awesome to me. Speaking of awesome, we need to see who will be the, this year's winner of Battle of the Grades. That's right. Big shout out to last year's 7th graders who are this year's 8th graders. They were the big winners last year. Yep, however, I have a question for the 6th and 7th graders. Are you going to step up? Can you handle the 8th graders or are you afraid? I think they're a little afraid to me. Bring it on, 6th and 7th graders. So how do we get points? Easy. Participate on competition days. For example, Spirit Week is in two weeks. That's right. Starting Monday, September 23rd, Isabel will be having its first Spirit Week of the year. Monday, September 23rd, wear mix max shoes and a hat. Yes, it could be a logo hat, but make sure it's school appropriate, so sports team or my cap, etc. Tuesday, September 24th is color day. Sixth graders wear red, seventh graders wear black, eighth graders wear blue. We are looking for shirts, not shoes, socks, or pants. Wednesday, September 25th is superhero day, so come dressed up as your favorite superhero and earn points for your grade. Thursday, September 26th is MLB Day, so we want to see your favorite baseball team. Go Dodgers! Friday, September 27th is Freaky Friday. That's right. Students will dress up like teachers and teachers will dress up like students. I'm going to dress like Miss Hicks. I have a great idea to dress up like. It's a secret though. You'll see. Mr. Lopez will be walking around random classes first period all that week and marking how many students participate and that is how many points you'll get in your grade. Speaking of points, let's look at our Connor wrestling team. They are practicing and preparing for the first match that will be the takedown tournament here at home in our gym. That's right. Come and see, sit in the nest and come watch and support your Condor wrestlers next Thursday night, September 19th. They take on Balboa, Matilla, Sohoa, and some more. <laughs> the match will start at 5 p.m. and the doors open at 4 and best of all, it's free. That sounds amazing. You know what else is amazing? What? We have a dance the next day. Yep, on Thursday, can, you can watch our wrestler battle on the mat, and then on Friday, September 28th, you can dance battle at the Back to the 80s dance party. Remember, there's two dances this year. The first dance is from 4 to 6, and it's only for 6th graders. No sneaking in 8th graders. There will be a second dance from 6.30 to 9 p.m., but it's only for 7th and 8th graders. Stay out, 6th graders. Be sure you buy your dance tickets early, so you don't have to wait in line and take your permission slip and $5 to the A's B table at lunch. If not, then you'll have to pay $6 at the door. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to meet our new teachers. We are going live with Samantha in three, two, one. Hey guys, I'm here with Miss Ring and we're going to be interviewing her today. Where did you grow up? I grew up in Wisconsin and then I moved to Oxnard when I was 11. Um, who's your favorite superhero? I'm going to go with Hawkeye. And Vans or Commons? Vans. Um, Katy Perry or Taylor Swift? Taylor Swift. And what's one interesting thing about yourself? I play Dungeons and Dragons on the weekend. Cool. Hey guys, I'm here with Mr. Noriega and we're going to be interviewing him. Where did you grow up? I grew up in Azusa, uh, California. That's close to Pomona, uh, the uh, San Gabriel Valley. Um, who's your favorite superhero? My favorite superhero would have to be Captain America. He's patriotic and he rocks the red, white, and blue. <laughs> um, Vans and Commons. Uh, I got a pair of Vans, so I had to say Vans. <laughs> Katy Perry or Taylor Swift? Hmm, tough choice. I'm gonna have to say though, Katy Perry. Um, one interesting fact about yourself. One interesting fact about myself would have to be I went through college, and because I did a lot of scholarships and grants, I have zero student debt. Oh, that's good. Thank you, Ms. Marina. Hey guys, I'm here with Ms. Abram, and we're interviewing her too. Um, where did you grow up? So I was born in Torrance, Long Beach, and I lived in Sacramento, Thousand Oaks, Long Beach. Who's your favorite superhero? Uh, probably Wolverine. Vans or Collins? Vans. Um, Katy Perry or Taylor Swift? Katy Perry? 
Probably more than Taylor Swift, yeah. One interesting fact about yourself. Uh, I like to bodyboard on the weekends. Cool. Thank you, Miss Ava. Thank you, Samantha. Thank you for interviewing some of our new staff. Maybe some of you found a person to switch with for your Freaky Friday. Well, that's all the news we have this week. I'm Lindsay. And I'm Chris. See you later. Bye.